Hey, this is time for the holidays. We wanted to give you guys a special holiday message for our fans. So we put together this amazing holiday film about zip codes. I, I like lizards. Tom, we're not supposed to be in character right now. I, I like lizards. <laughs> zip, zip codes! Ah! What's happening? Whoa, the original cup song. Zipcod. Proper care of your cod bees. Ah! I'm seizuring! If one of the swinging six is Marlon Brando, I'm leaving. Well, hello, my friend. How do you do? I stuck putting in your shoe. Listen to what we have to say to each and every one of you. The irony is that each of those stools were used in a suicide attempt. So, what does this have to do with Christmas again? I guess people mail packages and stuff. Use Gorilla Glue. It's up to us to see the post office through? They're screwed. Should I do my hair like hers? Which one? Does it matter? Zip codes toward those worthless commies. We stole this mailbox from Biff Tanner. Now it's a difference to... What, stork? I don't know what he's going to say there. Cremated in coffins. I think the most disturbing thing about this film is that lamp. Think about it. Zap! Pal! Uh, I miss how things were before Obamacare. Hey, we found Duffy. If this turns into a hygiene commercial, I'm leaving. Is that Dan as a caveman? So, this will be in my nightmares. And football was born. It wasn't so long ago that communication was a simple act. Got to carve this into the, the Twitter rock. Is limited. So, man's ingenuity found ways to bridge distance. And then he invented cheeseburgers. And type of oh, I'm so error. baked right now. And then he invented crack. To carry messages across vast distances, man developed roads... What do cigarettes have to do with zip codes anyway? Just go with it. I'm sure it will make sense. Bunions. I think they're demonstrating how muscle milk is made. And a rare assortment of aching limbs. And a third leg. Yes, up until recently... <laughs> Early pornography. Awesome. What matter if it took two weeks to go from New York to Atlanta? Why not burn your sister for being a witch? If the letter from Uncle Ben arrived a day or so later, nobody fussed. Unless Uncle Ben was mailing his rice. Wheels, footpaths, and the puff of wind against sail. <coughs> Distance was measured by weeks and months. Everything was a far time off. Frankly, narrator, then, I don't give a slowly, damn. The country got up steam. Commerce shook off its sea anchor and headed westward all the width of the continent. Indians there were slaughtered in masses. Speed. It was glorious. Trains were originally Everything tiny. Was coming up to date in the Kansas cities and the Portlands. Slightly behind was Utah and Alabama, but that was just to be expected. Aspect of our economy. The post office became the prime artery of commerce. Back when the term postal the time, meant something completely different. Able to keep up. If the mail piled high, put on another piece of equipment. Throw this away. That didn't do the trick. Add a few more clerks or a flock of carriers. All of this connects somehow, right? Those annoying singing one, kids did have a point, carried right? More advertising in a week than all the newspapers and magazines could carry in a year. It was the country's bill collector. The country's anthrax the spreader. And runner. The volume of mail delivered leaped to 20 billion. By 1948, it had doubled. Ironically matching my Aunt Susie. This year, doubled again. Nearly 80 billion pieces of mail. I never realized Literally, they handled our mail so carelessly. I'm never using the U.S. Postal Service again. Drowned in a sea of mail. 
Where do we go from here? And how many of those bags Patchwork. have bodies in them? Piecemeal that? solutions based upon obsolete transportation routes will not work. And yet our the laws are still filed in a small wooden box. And the post office has the only logical answer. Putting funny Zip backgrounds code. behind the Mail country. No, the answer is to cover the country in an AIDS quilt. Distance between two distant points. Well, that must be an old map. It still includes Five Florida. What? Well, like Florida washed away in that flood nine years ago? No, it didn't. It didn't? No. Precision. Oh my gosh, I have to check on my aunt. Space aged speed and precision, and by that we mean insanely slow and to the wrong address. Are they talking about Sherbert? Not his real voice. No way to know what he was gonna say there. It takes over your brain! Boom, 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 boom. Do I still have to jump rope? I have a cramp. Each one with the mild erection. Yeah, I said it. We've already got it started. Yeah, I can help you lift this. After all, I'm a man. The next two digits go hand in hand to a major post office over land. Since each big section has town after town, we need these numbers to really narrow things down. Full we of children who might possibly drown. Happy holidays, folks. I can't understand why they never made this into a Broadway musical. Hey, a couple of zeros. Really nice. Yeah, they look like it. Number. Terrific! That's right, kids. You're just a number in the eyes of the government. You can plainly see just five little numbers, quick as can be. But if you have a question or you have a doubt, if you're still not sure what the whole thing's about, you're a dumb wow. number, zip code defined. Means city I wonder how many takes they had to do to get the signs straight. But don't take it from us. Don't take it from me. It'll Find fill you with out. glee. You'll see. I think the guy on the far right was in Mission Impossible. It's a deal than you get from any other post office department. It stinks! Yes, zip code is a better deal. A Moving better deal than what? Straight line. Straight I think we found this and film's hidden agenda. Day, it could be Cupid's arrow. It could be murder. Time before zip code, a boy... A girl, a lemur, a valentine. Long distance relationships, they work because of the post office. Who lived with his parents? If they switch bodies, I'm leaving. She tore it up just yesterday. I care in that special way. Picking up all kinds of bacteria and various diseases. Happy holidays, folks! I wish I didn't live on a movie set. So, was this film made with tax dollars? I think it was funded with stamp costs. Either way, I'm seriously angry right now. I may as well be slutty. John Stamos? So remember, kids, long-distance girlfriends will cheat on you. There are no exceptions. This reminds me of my prom night. The Postal Service has ruined me. There will be blood. And now, another Valentine. Carefully zip-coded. Here and here. A different girl. Still far away by Frisco Bay. I think they're but overestimating the, the amount of girls who live in Frisco who actually like boys. They've shown two. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, I want that cardboard stand-up. It'd be awesome to sneak into people's homes and just hang it above their bed. Get away from me, John Stamos. Bad Stamos. Bad! Dude, it's the same guy that stole the first girl. Well, if it works, I'll try and fix it. What I want to know is, is why does that guy keep trying to find girls who live on the other side of the country? Just screams, commitment issues. Zip code. Making love happen since 1967. Nothing will come between them except for a psychotic cartoon mailman and a creepy logo.
And those zip codes so who wants to list all the things disturbing the about this shot? I don't think we have time to listen to them all. I want to start the with the women's off. clothes. Have you ever asked yourself this question? Why do postal clerks get indigestion? Wow, can't say that I have. It's all the stamp glue we take into our so postal workers have glue sniffing addictions? Yet, that's that's really really kind of specific. It's from trying to read the American hand. Does the post office have nurses? Throughout the land. This letter will prove exactly what we said. The name of the city simply can't. A lot of people have way oh, too much time on their hands. Oak, Oak Rap. Oak Hurst. Tuscaloosa. Oak what? Oak Wood. Tuscaloosa. 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 What are the chances? Now you see what we mean. If the writing's no good, this letter might as well be. As a writer on the show, I have to admit, I hope the Swinging Six made many, many, many more of these shorts. Just try this problem on for size. I got a letter here for somebody from Springfield. Springfield? But Springfield was wiped off the earth from an act of God. <laughs> Happy holidays, folks. I'm from Springfield, Pennsylvania, and there's been a mistake. This letter is apparently for me. Is that guy a blackjack dealer or something? Why else would he be wearing that hat? It appears to be addressed to a Mr. Simpson, which even confuses things more. I can honestly say, I've never asked myself why postal clerks get an digestion. All I can think about is, where is that piano music coming from? Being from Arizona, I'm surprised that sign hasn't melted. Illinois! Where dead people can still vote. Nebraska. Yes, we really are a state. Um, New Jersey was upside down. Should we reshoot that? No? Okay. I think we should all form a line and do this at the mall. I'm not sure all music and dance came from black culture. Psych, 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 psych. We run all your mail under this filthy sewage grate. Under control. It is as up to date as the computer. Oh yeah, that as computer looked pretty up to date, all right. Code scanner. It is a success. Just ask Sparky, the mailman. Oh yes, it's a total success. Remember, who can put zip in your postal system? I know. I put zip in the postal system because I have email. The Honorable Lawrence F. O'Brien. Looks like a triangle. One way we can measure the success of our zip code program is reading everything of off of the cue cards. Send us their postal specialists to study our system and to determine how much of it is adaptable for their own purposes. Move the cue card. They come because of a simple fact. Rhino butter. Zip code works. It works for the post office. It works for all who use the mails. Even the gays Walters, and minorities. Bulk mailers. Or private citizen. That's the most work that guy to has get done any in a zip week. code numbers you may need, including your own. Just call your local post office. Or Google it like any sane person would. Beach party! Come on, guys! Blue for buckwheat sake? What? Now I'm assuming zip code is a metaphor for naughty naked time. It's time to worship the codes as God and let them completely run every facet of your lives. Now do it. Now I tell you. Okay, I've Googled it. Apparently this is the only film that The Swinging Six ever made. I am totally bummed by that. Two guys for each of us, yay. Zip code, blah, blah, blah. Zip code. Yeah, na na na. Call will be I'm not coming down. I think I took too much this time. I need help. An army of Mr. Zip. Ah! I'm going to track each of these people down. Stop. It's the holidays. And get them to sign a picture of this. Jeez, what were you thinking? Is it just me? Or do all of those little guys look like total... Perverts. That's everything they know? Actually, I'm not surprised by that. 
The swinging six make the flailing five sound like the twanging two. I wish I could just start punting those annoying little creepy dudes. Produced by Lee Harvey Rothberg. So, they made an entire film about zip codes? That's, well, that's just super. I think we found the cause for going postal. I have a feeling they actually did tell us everything they know. Everything may not actually be okay. The post office takes no responsibility for the state of things. Results may vary. Happy holidays, everyone. Be sure to use zip codes from now on. Zip, zip codes! codes! Wait, wait, okay, wait, who's saying what? You got that worked out? Oh, hi, I didn't see you there. Happy holidays from Rabbit Ears. Hold it still! I said still! <laughs> Happy holidays from rabbit ears. 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 Yes. Happy holidays from rabbit ears. Yep, yep, and yep. Happy holidays from rabbit ears. Happy holidays from Rabbit Ears! Happy holidays from Rabbit Ears! Come on, shoot, I can't even sing. Well, happy holidays from Rabbit Ears. And now my friend will say so. Is that Jeff? We hope you we wear this stupid hat. We told you everything we know. Okay, so you want me to hold this right here? Go back over by the fence over there. There. Right. Oh, hi. Happy holidays. We're grabbing here. Everything will be all, everything will be all, everything.